What's up, guys? Back in another video. My name is Sh Tech, Top Tech Guides. I am here to teach you how exactly do you get your NAT type open in Call of Duty Black Ops 4. Now, this is for PC and also console. So, this can apply to both. So, regardless of whatever one you're using, it should open the NAT type for both. So let's figure out how we're going to do this. If we go over to here, go to go to settings, obviously it doesn't show our networking interface. If we go to our name right here, go all the way down to info and go to network right here. Now we can see the net the network configuration. As you can see, um uh my bandwidth should be a lot bigger than that, but cuz I have way more better internet connection speed but for your NAT type obviously it's currently open so I'll teach you how you can open up your NAT type through your router although all routers are different so I cannot provide support for all routers but you'll have to figure out on the port for how to port forward on your router and how to open up the NAT type in UDP on your personal router so I will show you how to do it on mine mine is a Linksys Cisco router so it is a very very decent router. Links to smart Wi-Fi. This is what mine is. Pretty decently expensive one too. So, as you can see, I'm in the Wi-Fi in the wire in the um, router settings. You want to use um, if you're ever playing games. You should always like as you can see this inter internet filters filter internet not redirections. Don't even bother with that. Just leave that alone. If you want an easy way of setting up. Um, setting up your router or setting up your computer to have, uh, you know, what is it called? Um, to have um, open NAT type, you can always use DMZ. Problem is, there's absolutely no freaking security. If you put it under DMZ, you'll have absolutely no security through that specific device, which will leave it, leave it pretty vulnerable to it, just about anything. Um, so you're, you're generally not going to want to do that. Um, the company um, Triarch has recommended it, but I don't recommend it at all. I have to go to Apps and Gaming and then go with Single Port Forward, and I named this one Call of Duty. If you open up the port 3074 on the protocol of UDP, as you can see right here, this is the internal IP address and enable. It will open up the port pretty freaking easy, just that simple. And if we head over to, I believe, connectivity into into I'm looking for the UDP settings here we go NAT enabled and then we need to find UDP UDP there it is you you uh, UPNP enable and there we go we can go ahead and click apply okay and that'll be it you don't have to do anything else I do have speed test in here but I can't I can't use it now that should all it takes, and all you need to do is sh shut off shut off your game and reload it, and the NAT type should be open. It mainly has to do with the uh, with the port for it. If you simply open up that port, it should open it up. And if you're having any um, having any issues, um, you can actually get this stuff. Or like if you're having issues connecting to certain players, you can actually get a lot of this information, or you can get a lot of your problems could be end up being your NAT type. If you open up your NAT type, it'll start working fine. But anyways, guys, hit me with a like, hit the subscribe button. If you want more videos like this, just leave in the comments of what game you want me to do, do it on. And simple as that. I'll see you guys on the next one.